All right, today I've got this Brent 657A, and this is a gravity wagon, or some people call them grain trains, uh, whatever you want to call it. We actually got this at a dealership. My brother picked it up, and it was on clearance. I think he gave like five bucks for it. It was the only one they had, or we would have bought more which this is a really good deal because these are normally like a $20 toy. They are made by Speccast. And um, they now have more variations. I think some of them even with duels on it. But anyways, we're going to take a look at this and I'm going to kind of compare it to the Ertl one. If you haven't seen, I just did a video on these earlier. Um, so check that video out if you want to see more on those J&Ms made by Ertl. But let's get into this. So first of all, the decal up here, Brent 657A, very clean decal, very sharp looking. I love the black around the top on these Brents. Nice looking windows. You got some detail here. Turn around to the back, really good. I love the triangle, the lights. Another good Brent decal, another window, really good on that. Same decal over here. And on the front, another window there too. Another thing, you can't probably tell on camera, but these are painted rims. They kind of got a cream color. So it's not just plastic like the Ertl ones are just white plastic. So these rims are a lot better on the spec cast ones. Uh, this is nice and painted here. Now one thing I am disappointed, the door does not open. Our Ertl ones do have an opening door. Um, so I was, from Speccast, I was hoping for a little more detail, especially for like a $20 toy. Even though we didn't give that, that's what these go for. Uh, the ladder is really good. You can see the ladder is a little thick on these. But this is more realistic looking over here, a little bit thinner. Um, the turn radius on this one's really good. Ertl one doesn't have the best turn radius. The Speccast one does. It turns full turn there. So that is nice. Now the interior on this is basic. Nothing. They kind of cheaped out on the inside. That's okay. They didn't put this, you know, the detail like what would like the Ertl one did. Um, but that's all right. They did do really good detail though on this side with the framing. Uh, really good detail on the running gear as well as you can see there. So from the outside it looks really good. Um, I wish they would have done a little more detail on the inside and it would have been cool if the door opened. But overall it's a really nice piece. Um, I would have a hard time giving $20 for it but since we got it on sale uh, it's cool to have. Nice little... Nice little cart. Anyways, if you haven't already, please go and check out the rest of our channel. We've got quite a few videos on there. I don't know how many at this point, but there's quite a few. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't. And we're going to keep trying to put a couple videos out a week at least. So keep watching and see what we got. Anyways, have a good night, everybody.